Do you remember how Janet was thinking about having a baby? So there'd be a possible bone marrow match if the treatments failed? Liberty told Dad that she was completely against it. But Janet's pregnant, isn't she? There's no guarantee that this baby yeah, will even this, be a this is match. good. This means that there's hope. In case the radiation treatments don't work, there's Parker, something else that might. did you hear what I said? There is no guarantee. I know. I know. And she may refuse the transplant. Let's just think positive, okay? Okay. But I, I do have a question. What about you and Dad? What does this baby mean for the two of you? I didn't mean for you to walk in on... On what, exactly? Dusty proposed. I should have told you. No, it's okay. You already did. When? Doesn't matter. I'm just glad that you're happy. And if he does that for you... He does. Good. You deserve it. I want you to be happy too, Jack. I'm sorry that things didn't work out for us. So am I, but this is good. I can tell. So, okay, I guess we'll start working on the annulment. Yeah, we have to do that or I'll have to arrest you for bigamy. <laughs> Thanks. Congratulations. Take good care of her. I plan to. Call the insurance company. That's for another round of treatment. Everything's, got it. everything's okay. You got it, Jack. Right. Uncle Jack. Will you bring Parker to see me before you guys leave? I want to say goodbye. Will do. We should make it to the airport in time to catch that last flight back to Oakdale. Mom, you, you did not answer my question about you and Dad. Does this baby mess things up for you guys? We'll be fine. We've been through a lot over the years. Well, this, is, this is pretty major. I mean, the kid's permanent. Yeah, that's true. I'm not going to say that it's going to be easy for me, because it's not. I'll handle it. Good. Yeah. You see, it's it's almost like I'm a grown-up now. It's crazy. It's about damn time, right? <laughs> Seriously, you're you're okay with raising this baby as your your stepchild? I can tell you that I'm okay with helping Jack and Janet raise this child. This child that I hope will help Liberty, which in turn will help you, my wonderful son. So you see, it's, it's all connected. Maybe you are actually growing up, which is a relief <laughs> since I've been raising you for so long. Yeah, you did a so-so job, too. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, you know I love your father very, very much. It's, it's taken a lot for us to get back to where we are here, so I'm not going to let anything get in the way ever again. You ready to go? Actually, I'd like to go say goodbye to Liberty. Could you guys pick me up on the way to the airport? Sure. Sure. Great. We'll see you soon. Sure. <sighs> so, how did Liberty take the news about the baby? She was angry until she saw the ring. Then she was okay Wait, with what it. What ring? Dusty proposed and Janet said yes. Hey. Well, that's great, Jack. You were worried about Janet being alone. Now she certainly won't be alone, no, will she? No, it's not that. I'm glad that she's. I'm glad that she's happy. I just don't know how I feel about Donovan raising my kid. Well, if I can handle you having a baby with another woman, you can handle this. You think so? Yes. Dusty won't be that child's father more than you. 
The baby will still be yours. So will I.